In Essex, we need to provide greater options for people to travel and to encourage safer, greener and healthier ways of getting around. Especially for shorter journeys, where we want walking and cycling to be the natural choice. Take the Army and Navy Junction, a vital gateway into and out of the city of Chelmsford. People regularly experience congestion and delays here during peak times in the mornings and evenings, affecting bus passengers, cyclists, pedestrians and drivers. This is expected to get worse in the future unless we do something different. We cannot simply keep building new roads. So the Chelmsford Future Transport Network strategy sets out a clear vision to transform transport through a zonal approach, with a strong focus on walking, cycling and bus travel particularly towards the city centre. The Army and Navy Sustainable Transport Package represents an opportunity to do just that, with an expansion of Sandon Park and Ride, a new park and ride site at Whitford, and wider pedestrian and cycle route improvements, all proposed as part of the project. Combined with junction layout improvements, the scheme will provide a long-term and sustainable solution that helps to make Chelmsford a city of the future. As part of the overall package, we have been thoroughly assessing four new road layout options at the Army and Navy Junction, which would enable improvements for walking, cycling, buses, park and ride and general traffic. Following our latest option assessment analysis, we have now decided to discount the two-way flyover option. Some people think we should build another flyover. However, a modern standard two-way flyover would be much bigger than the previous flyover and take up considerably more space. It would encourage more car journeys and increase city centre congestion rather than supporting the park and ride, walking and cycling, which goes against our adopted Chelmsford Future Transport Network strategy. The flyover would also have the largest accident, noise and air quality impacts and the longest and most disruptive construction programme, which would have the biggest impact on the local economy. By removing this option, which does not meet the wider objectives for transport in Chelmsford, we can concentrate on the options that would make a real difference. Having now finalised our shortlist of options, we will soon be asking your views. The remaining options for the junction, separate T-junctions, Hamburger roundabout and enlarged roundabout, provide the best opportunity to improve journeys for all transport users with key improvements for sustainable transport to create a lasting legacy at this vital gateway. We look forward to sharing more information on the improvement package and hearing your views during the public consultation this summer. For more information about the Army and Navy Sustainable Transport Package, please visit www.essex.gov.uk forward slash army and navy.